The City of Seattle has been working on a mandate to require building owners to upgrade their building via seismic retrofit. Hi, I'm Ryan from Seattle Seismic. We're here today to show how we can help building owners retrofit their buildings, especially unreinforced masonry buildings. Brick, as a building material, is very brittle. Unreinforced masonry buildings are structural brick, and so what can happen in an earthquake is they can crumble apart. One way to identify if a building is an unreinforced masonry building is if it has a header course. So you'll see the bricks are horizontal and there'll be three or four or five rows of horizontal bricks and then there'll be the brick turned sideways uh, and that'll continue all the way up the building. The City of Seattle's put together a really good database on unreinforced masonry buildings. It lists every address, every building that's unreinforced masonry in all of Seattle. I would encourage anyone who's wondering about whether or not their building is unreinforced masonry to check out the database. It's gonna be pretty black and white, yes or no, whether or not the building is unreinforced masonry. What's typically needed for an earthquake retrofit is number one, the parapet. The parapet is a three or four foot wall on the roof and extends above the roof line, but what can happen is that can fall off and hit the sidewalk. So parapet bracing is the number one thing that the City of Seattle requires as part of the retrofit. The other big items during a retrofit are to tie the unreinforced wall to each floor. You'll see on this project we're working, we do have a rod that goes all the way through the wall and then there's a plate washer on the outside. Old buildings have this already. There's a decorative rosette plate. For this particular building, we're taking that existing rosette plate and adding a new connector. Seattle Seismic can help you from start to finish on your unreinforced masonry project. We can help you with the plans, we can help you with the permitting, we'll do the construction for you. There's repair work that's often involved and we'll handle that for you. At the end of the job, we'll wrap things up, we'll give you inspection reports, we'll work with your insurance company and fill out forms as needed. Oftentimes in commercial spaces, there's a tenant occupying the building, so we try to make it really easy on them. We work through this job around access hours, people's desks, we masked off the workspace, made sure it was safe and clean. There's a huge need for retrofitting commercial buildings in the city of Seattle. Whether that be unreinforced masonry buildings, apartments, or warehouses, we'd love to help you out with that.